every year I, I would think you know what happened to that guy you know did he ever go back and did he take his life and all those sorts of things so yeah it, it had really stuck with me I just thought that the best thing for for me and for my parents as well was you know if I wasn't here anymore and I just thought it would just be best for everyone so I went onto the edge of this bridge and um, this stranger came up to me and he began engaging with me and, and he helped me over the edge of the bridge to the pavement and I remember there was still the same really difficult stuff going on in my head but I had some hope from, from talking to this stranger. But it was in my mid-twenties, I started talking, I started making videos about my experience and I said I want to help people, I want to help people. I struggled so much because, because I kept silent, because I was so embarrassed, because I was so ashamed. And I said I don't want anyone else to go through that. And mm. then I decided to find the guy that stopped me on the bridge because I wanted to thank him for what he did. It had such a massive impact on me. I couldn't believe it, I just, I couldn't believe it when, when they said to me, we found the guy that you are looking for, the guy that stopped you on the bridge. It was really special because I was, I was obviously in a different place and I was able to say, you know, I've come. I've come a long way since that day on the bridge. And because of you, because of what you did, that's, that's, yeah. And it was really special to be able to sit down with him and to, to, to say that to him. It blows my mind when I think about what's come out of such a bad situation. Myself and Neil, you know, we're going around and we are trying to spread this message of, of hope and recovery to as many people as we can, you know, whether it be in, in the NHS, in, in, in prisons, or particularly for me, young people in schools, because if I'd have got that message when I was growing up, I think things would have been really different. There aren't enough words to describe how special Johnny Benjamin is and, and how he's changed the lives of so many people.